If two lines are intersected by a third line called a transversal, then eight angles are formed. In our drawing, line PQ is a transversal to lines AB and CD. The angles lying between the two lines and on opposite sides of the transversal are called alternate interior angles. Angle 1 and angle 2 are alternate interior angles, as are angles 3 and 4. Notice there will always be two pairs of alternate interior angles. Angles lying outside of the two lines and on opposite sides of the transversal are called alternate exterior angles. There are two pairs of alternate exterior angles, angles 5 and 6 and angles 7 and 8. Corresponding angles are angles on the same side of the transversal and which are either both above or below the two lines. Angles 5 and 4, angles 1 and 8, angles 7 and 2, and angles 3 and 6 are the four pairs of corresponding angles in our drawing. When a transversal crosses two parallel lines, then a special relationship exists between certain angles. If two parallel lines are cut by a transversal, then alternate interior angles are congruent, alternate exterior angles are congruent, corresponding angles are congruent. It is also true that if two lines are cut by a transversal and alternate interior angles are congruent or alternate exterior angles are congruent or corresponding angles are congruent, then we can conclude that the lines are parallel.